Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new XD tutorial. I'm using here XD and today I'll make a web page home, home of the web page actually. And the menu and everything, how to do that type of creative work. Let's start. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. And the basic of all XD in the playlist i'll provide the playlist in my video description please check it out at first i'll take an artboard which is like uh, the 1920 or 780p so here you'll get all the stuffs over here the web 1920 and 1366 which one you do prefer please select that one so i'm selecting 1920 and giving the name of this home so this one is my artboard and i'll work in this artboard here at first i took a uh, shape like blue colors so going to the shape actually the rectangle shape and taking the color from here okay turning off the border and taking the fill color from the color picker like this so i'll provide you the color code the color code is 0041 d5 if you apply or put this code actually in your one you can get this color okay and after that i'll draw three boxes which is the square boxes going to the square shape again and drawing three boxes so it could be the 420 and 420 height and weight you can take these things as your own wishes okay then i'm just taking another one and another one so selecting all three things and making them into proper alignment and making them to group and select over there it will be middle according to the artboard and now right press and ungroup so here i'll turn off the border and you can put the shadow over here if you need actually so i'm putting the shadow a little bit now i'll put the photo over there i got some photo from unsplash.com or you can download them from there or you can uh, get the plugins for which is from the unsplash.com and here you can search like uh, anger okay it will find out and providing like that but i do prefer to select the photo manually just because of it will provide you the random photo but i downloaded that photos previously and you can uh, get the link down my video description okay i'm going to the file and import i'll import this photo and making the size according to the shape like this and put it in the back select here and right press mask with the shape so those who are the user of the windows or windows user please uh, use the right press or the things which is uh, very helpful to you in my case i'm getting over here but uh, all the panels and the here file edit everything in this portion you'll get the three lines which is the main menu of the windows user okay now i'm going to the file again and import now i'll import this one and making it smaller like this and send it to the back layer third bracket press the controller command and press the third bracket it will go to the next layer right press and make mask with the shape okay that's fine now number three going to the file again and going to the import options now i'll import this photo and making it smaller like this according to the shape and send it to the back layer select these two things press the shift and hold it right press and mask with the shape now this portion is done now i'll write down the letters like this so i'm using here the helvetica font if you want to get the download link of the font please check out my video description going to the text and writing a okay and i'm choosing this one into bold you have to increase the font size like uh, 200 that's fine or you can make it bigger 
more bigger you, you can press the shift button and hold it and just drag the anchor point you'll get this one bigger and press alter option button and making it copy later i'll change this like g and s so these three letters representing the photos itself just because of a for anger is for sadness like that and now time to make the shape like circles which is the ornamental shape I'm going to the circle and making this one bigger like that turning off the fill color in the border color i'll make it white and giving the thickness which is 100 that's fine and putting this one into the next layer press the control or command button and make it just send back to the layer okay now turning the opacity down like uh, 50 or 20 percent 20 percent is good and press the alter option button and make it copy and press the shift and hold it make it smaller like this that's good and now rest of the thing will do at first the menu which is uh, here the main menu draw a line like this make the line or border color which is white and border thickness two is good okay and now write down all the stuffs like here making the font size like 12 or 20 is good for me that's good and home you can make it cap all cap or you can make this one like a cap or a small mix up whichever you prefer you can work with that so oh, i'm making copy by pressing alter and option button and dragging this one giving the name our services giving this one like home that's fine and about us and appointment or contact that's good now i'll make the search button uh, actually icon so taking circle like this and turn off the fill color giving the border color white and thickness 2 is good and going to the line tool and making the line like this 45 percent and thickness to color white and join them to like this and you can make it smaller like that that's fine select these two things making it group or you can make it smaller like that and then i'll uh, provide the menu I like that so going to the line tool drawing a line like this make it white and copy them by pressing alter option button and copy one two three and four selecting all three steps three and four making them to smaller version so it representing that uh, you can scroll or you have another menus except the home button or it's just insisting you to scroll the page that's fine now here the demo text uh, so here the name i'm making copy this one this one is a thought provoking name you can use your um, the name properly so i'm taking this one into other side just because of okay that's fine going to the text tool taking another text controller command v and making it bigger like that making these all caps and align it according to the artboard now we'll use here the lorem ipsum which is that demo text so here is the placeholder and you can give the text like that but i want this into the lighter font that's good 
you can put your um, the proper write up over there that's good and here one two three four everything is good now i'll make the button which is the appointment how to make that button going to the rectangle just making it like this and here text that is appointment and making it a little bit uh, light or that's good and making it all caps making it 12 pt and changing the color into blue actually this taking this one here i'll suggest you to make it bold otherwise it won't be like uh, the visual here i'm taking another line from here and making that like this so just bring that layer into upper side yeah that's good and to work with this just making it smaller like this yeah that's good and now time to make the logo from here the logo is uh, literally the easy type logo here turn off the fill color giving the border white here the five that's good and alter option button hold it and make it, it smaller like this and like this and like this but one thing is that i'll change the thickness from here just suppose this one is a five i'll make it six which is good and this one is four and this one is two is good and one that's fine now write down the name here press alter option button and you can copy this one this one is the logo of the website or you can make those things into group press the shift and option at a time actually you shouldn't squeeze that things like uh, by the side you have to make squeeze or that dragging into left to right or like corner to corner another last one here the triangle drawing the triangle and making it rotation press alter option button hold it and drag it here in the middle of the box okay that's fine and select all three and turn on the border select the color from here and giving the opacity down that is 80 percent is good so that's all for today hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section please everyone stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers as well today i'm asmr signing out bye bye